loose. Buddy! What's it been? A week? Two weeks? Sorry I didn't call sooner. I've had to stay low. Real low. Like, underground. Every time I pop up, Waller's idiots are there, and they don't seem to care whether they bring me in alive. I gave her Harley, the girl of my dreams, on that bridge. And what did I get for thanks? Waller tried to shoot me. The only thing she cares about is getting this virus back. If that ain't happening. Well, I'm sick of keeping out of sight. I put together a little crew. It's time to get things moving again. Our plan to bring them all to justice. I want you to be there to see it. Today, I'm gonna make Waller and the agency wish they never missed with us. Our fight starts now, Batman. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to provoke them. I have to stop this. Be careful. Since you defended John, you're on Waller's most wanted list as well. Best keep a low profile. If I move now, he'll see me. We better make sure she doesn't come to get her. We have to catch this guy. Those whack jobs is gonna give him up. Harrison, make sure. Automatic weapon. It's extreme, even for the agency. Waller's desperate. this one. I'll need to distract him. Hmm. I could use a bat stunner to fry the light. That should draw his attention. Right now. We ain't giving him up. He cares about Gotham. You're all gonna pay. What you and your agency are doing here isn't right. Ah, tell me where John Doe is. I ain't no rat. That's too bad. Rats have a knack for survival. Kill him. Ah. Agents are crazy, Batman! They're gonna kill us! This stops now, Agent. Waller said you'd be trouble. That you'd protect John Doe. But I'm thinking, that can't be right. Doe's a monster. And these clowns here? They call him a hero. John is my friend. Yes, he's made mistakes. Grave ones. But he doesn't deserve to be hunted down by the likes of you. That's disappointing. You help them, you're helping him. If you're helping John Doe, you're the enemy too. Fire! Hit him again! Debut! 
<laughs> John? Nope. Better than John. Come on, partner. Time for some justice. Team, don't you think? We do make a pretty good team. Right! We're gonna do such great things! I know it! John? Yeah. Joker! What? There is no more John Doe. It's Joker now. It's my hero name. Like, you know? Batman. I tried out a few other ones. You know, I like it. Oh, I thought you would. It's a name people are going to remember. We've done good work today, Batman. Waller still doesn't have the virus. We kept the agency from killing my friends. Tried two out of four new moves. Wait a second. Wasn't that Harrison guy, like, right over there? wants Batman alive. I don't care what she wants. Do as you're told. That 
It's gotta hurt him, right? <laughs> I would enjoy tearing your head from him. Enough with the monologue. Finish the job. You pitiful little man. Call that monster off. Let go. <laughs> from luchador to pavement stain? You will pay for killing my friend. What are you? Riddler! Waller told me what you did. You let Batman defeat him, and then you struck like a coward. No, I didn't, Batman. I, I, I didn't. You would work with such a man? A murdering coward? I said I didn't kill him. Waller's a liar. I didn't kill Riddler. <laughs> What was that? You... I can't... I, I can't believe you! You shouldn't have stopped me! Don't you remember who this is? Look how many innocent people he's killed! Stop! He's been subdued. He's no longer a threat. No longer a threat? He accused me of killing Riddler. Why does Waller think you killed Riddler? Uh, I, I don't know. I... She probably did it. She's probably trying to pin it on me. But I didn't. You know that, right? <clears throat> Batman, you're, you're hurt. Stay where you are. You are both under arrest. I need a quick touch-up. And I'm not alone. I'll come to you. Silly coordinates. Get it? <laughs> you must be John. He goes by Joker now. You know who I am? Bruce has mentioned you, yes. Really? What'd you tell him about me? All good things, I hope. Alfred knows you're a friend of mine. And any friend of Batman's? Bruce, I know. 
We're tight like that. Uh, yes, he informed me. That's great! No secrets between us. We're all part of the club. Wow! The Alfred! I've been collecting tabloid photos of Bruce for years, and you're in the background of at least a third of them. You're hurt. Let me have a look. Ah. Let's get this off you. I'll take care of stapling the wound. Can you? I'll prepare the compress. Can I help, Al? So, Joker. What's up? You've got a new look. Awesome, right? You'd be amazed what you can find in thrift stores. Also on mannequins in fancy stores when no one's looking. Certainly makes an impression. Well, I was aiming for a Batman. But me! Dark and scary. Like my best bud. But also flashy and fun. <laughs> it finally feels like the right skin. Uh-huh. When you jumped off the bridge, that was one hell of a drop. What happened after? That was crazy, right? <laughs> it seemed like a fast getaway, terminal velocity and all. Anyway, I hit, sploosh, and it was dark and cold and wet for a while. Then I ended up grabbing onto some flotsam. Or was it jensum? No, 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 it was flotsam. Floated on that until I hit the shore, found Frank from the stack deck, and got some dry clothes. Gave me a different outlook, you know? New lease on life. <laughs> Glad it worked out. That looks a lot like a batarang. A batarang? No, I don't even see how you'd think. Uh oh. Yeah, maybe. But, but it isn't. It's totally unique. It's a Joker Ray. Uh huh. They're really warm. They've been in my pocket all day. I should get back to my arm. <laughs> of course. <laughs> I don't want you getting gangry. <sighs> no, I can't just infect it with that piece still in there. All day with that accent. It's That's like gonna have to come out. Come to life. I bet it comes in very handy around Christmas. Well, this ought to be fun. Maybe. Nerd. British before I come. Does this sound natural? Oi, you there, boy. Get the queen her beans for breakfast. How's that sit with you? Not well. Your honesty is appreciated. So, I'm dying to know. What was Bruce like as a little tyke? An angel. <laughs> Shouldn't close it yet. Day. Might get infected. Yes, if you discount all... I'm guessing there's no way this doesn't sting. <laughs> I knew it! I bet it was quite the production getting this one to go to oh, bed. Damn it. <sighs> no, Alfred. I am the knight. A few of these should do the job. Hey, Alfred, where does one go to learn? Oh, color? come on. Is there school? Is that what the B and MBA stands for? Okay. It's done. Good. We've had too much practice as of late. <sighs> Guess it's just one of those plain luxuries, huh? Having someone like Alfred to take care of. You're kind of his ward, huh? Do people still use that word? To be honest, I'm not sure why he puts up with me. <laughs> I often wonder myself. Oh, you guys are so cute. Alfred, I kind of got hurt in that scuffle too. Do 
you think? Um... Oh, come on, it's hardly a... Please. Mm. Damn it, that stinks! <sighs> in, in a really heartfelt, caring kind of way. It's Waller. Batman. We know what you did, Waller. You're gonna regret. Sorry. Sorry. So you're with our mutual friend. Good. It'll make this convenient. I want John Doe. Joker! I'm sorry. John Doe and the virus. In two hours. Or I go public with your identity. I don't want to burn you down, Bruce. But I will. Go to hell, Waller. Oh, grow up, Bruce. The virus. Your Joker. At the GCPD. Two hours. She's going to kill me! Kill me or turn me into a slave like Bane! And look what happened to him! I don't want to have some maniac stab Waller me! Waller won't stop coming after you until she gets the virus. But we can't give it to her. We have to destroy it. We do? Why? Not that I'm second-guessing you. I just want a reason. You know why. Yeah, I guess I do. It's dangerous, could fall into the wrong hands, the whole city could die, etc. With the virus gone, Waller won't see you as much of a threat. Well, I don't like the sound of that. She's going around telling lies, pinning murders on me. She has to pay for what she's done. I could put just the slightest hint of virus in Waller's shampoo, or maybe her perfume. Technically, I'd still be giving her the virus. I only want to see her melt. A little liquefy her insides. Heroes don't resort to murder to solve their problems. But it's so effective! I don't know. Dr. Leland did say I had trouble letting things go. No issue. So what am I supposed to do? Give up my grudges? What am I gonna lie awake at night stewing over them? It just makes me so angry. You have to rein in your darker impulses. That pain will only rot you from the inside out. Uh. Well, if you say it's the right thing to do, Trusting you on this. Now? Right here. That's it? That's it. Completely inert now. <laughs> Joker, Bruce and I need a moment. Oh, okay. I'll uh, check the perimeter. I'm relieved to see he listens to you. You can balance him out. Just don't take your eyes off him. Coast is clear. Waller has leverage on me. We need a countermeasure. Perhaps someone on the inside can help. Someone who's lost faith in Waller's crusade. You have someone on the inside? Agent Amon Avesta. She changed her tune about Waller after the raid on the Sanctus facility. If she's looking for a way to fight back, you could give it to her. She's our best bet. Batman. Waller's threatened to reveal my identity if I don't hand over Joker and the virus. I need some information on her. Something to negotiate with. Well... You came to the right person. When do you need it? I'm meeting her at the GCPD in two hours. Meet me on the roof in one. I'll have a little present for you. We're taking the Batmobile? We're taking the Batmobile?
going to be so great! Me and you taking down Waller. Joker and Batman, heroes of Gotham. <laughs> We're not here for a fight. You need to make yourself scarce. Waller is only a few floors below us. All right, I'll do the dignified thing and hide. So if things go south, I can surprise them from the shadows. <laughs> No, I... I know. I, I just need a place to stay for a little while. It's just... Why had car paid up a... I, I'm sorry, I have to go. I'll call you later, okay? Batman, I'm glad you came. <sighs> Waller's really gonna do it. If you don't give her Joker, she'll shout your identity from the rooftops. I know you said that things were okay between us, but I can't shake the feeling I'm to blame. After the fallout with Harley at the bridge, now this... I'm sorry I told Waller your secret. Let me make it up to you. I found something on Waller. Something big. I threw together a document. Details just how dirty her hands are. Sanctus, the experiments, Riddler. It's a little unbelievable, but it's worse than I thought. When the agency initially dissolved Sanctus, Waller was responsible for cleanup. In public record, she did exactly that. But that isn't what happened. No. She saved samples and data. She just couldn't let it go. Not when it had so much potential. And someone from Sanctus got their hands on it. I've seen enough. With this in your pocket, Waller loses her leverage over you. Thank you, Ramon. I guess it's all over now. It's only a matter of time before Waller realizes what I've done. She'll want to keep this buried, so it's unlikely she'll take this to internal affairs. But that won't stop her from ending my career. Or from making my life a nightmare. Come work with me. We'd be lucky to have you. At Wayne Enterprises? Or should I get fitted for body armor? I'd go with Wayne Enterprises. Better benefits. I might take you up on that. Thank you. Well, it's just you and Waller now. Hopefully the next time I see you, it will be to talk about my salary. Well, well, well. Sorry to interrupt. Not only are you aiding and abetting a wanted criminal, you corrupted one of my most loyal agents. Someone I trusted. Someone I took under my wing. She works with me now, right, Avesta? So you won't even try to deny it. You've crossed a line, Batman. You helped that maniac escape with the virus. The virus is destroyed. I saw to it myself. Destroyed? Fine. Well, I don't see John Doe wrapped up in a bow. Are you here to take his place? Because that's not what I asked for. I'm pretty sure I was clear on that. I'm here to make a deal. A deal? With you? You'll want to hear what he has to say. I'm done listening. They all work for me now. A special task force for special problems. Oh my god. Even your old friend Catwoman. Catwoman? Don't give her anything, Batman. She's... Ah! Did I say you could talk? You're outmatched. Time to stop this foolishness and get back into line. With the rest of the team. You intolerable... Let kind woman go. Now! You're in no position to make demands. Not to me. This is wrong, Waller. You can't use criminals to do your dirty work. Why should good people die fighting the likes of them? Or the likes of you and John Doe? You put my people in the hospital, protecting a maniac who killed at least three of my agents. A maniac who stabbed me in the gut. 
You're on the wrong side of this. You have to see that. There's not a right and wrong side to this. You and I both know that things are more blurry than that. Just look at everything you've done. What do you mean? What did she tell you? There's nothing on me I can't handle. Whatever you think you've got will bounce off me like rain off an armored truck. You know why they call me the Wall, Batman? Because you can't... You know if your superiors see this, it destroys your career. <laughs> what do you want? I want you and the Agency out of Gotham today. Okay. With the virus gone, my work here is done. I'll order my people to pack That's up... That's not all. Don't push it, Batman. I still know your identity. This is a stalemate, not a rout. Let Catwoman go. She helped against the Pact. She's not like the others. Oh, please. You're asking me to let a wanted criminal out on the streets? So unlike you. I'll tell you what. You want your little friend? I'll give her to you. On one condition. Hand over Doe. You know he'll be better off locked away. Better for himself and for everyone else. Otherwise, we're even. Me and my people are out of this godforsaken town. I won't betray him. Not even for that. Then our business is concluded. For now. No! No, 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 no! That's not acceptable! Not at all! What the hell? It's John Doe. Oh, put it! Come out, come out, wherever you are. You've got the biggest villain in Gotham right in front of you. And you're just letting her waltz on out of town? That is so very disappointing. You'll be safer when she's gone. We all will. You're letting her off the hook. You think you're some kind of force for justice, Joker? Don't you see how ridiculous that is? What's ridiculous is that anyone believes your lies! You blame me for your crimes when we both know you killed Riddler! Are you serious? Think whatever you want. You will never be a hero. How dare you? You're worse than me. That makes me the hero, and this is what heroes do to villains! What are you doing? Doing what you apparently can't! Shining a light on the shadiest part of Gotham! Kill him! With pleasure! Not yet! What do you think?
You and your stupid toad! Batman! The Caller! Catwoman, detain Batman. The rest of you, take care of Doe. <gasps> Sorry, but I think you can handle it. Switch. One wrong move and Waller pulls the trigger. I can't risk testing her. Then don't hold back. I can take it. You think so? Thanks. I owe you one. Back off, cat lady! Enough! You've cornered Batman! Give up, Joker! Now! Or I'll take you both down! Last chance! <laughs> Batman! <coughs> oh my god! <coughs> On three. One, two, three! One more time. How do we stop the bleeding? Suit. See you. <laughs> Batmobile. 
It'll get me home. You got it. I love you. Stay with me. Batman? Batman! A guy walks into a doctor's office. A guy says, uh, Doc, I've got this thing with my hands. It won't stop shaking and it's, it's driving me mad. And the, uh, the doctor says, Have you been drinking a lot? And the guy says, <laughs> No, not, uh, not really. Oh, no. Not you two. I guess Joker's made an impression on everyone. <clears throat> oh, no, no. This was in my repertoire long before Joker. Uh, almost prescient of me. When you were just a little taller than my knee, i tell it and you'd laugh and laugh. I thought I was quite hilarious. I haven't seen you laugh like that in a long while. I decided my bedside manners could use some adjustment. Admonishing you never seems to get us anywhere. Try not to move until the painkillers settle in. That leg still needs to heal, as do the third, eighth, and tenth ribs. How did I get here? Uh, Miss Kyle, she managed to get you into the Batmobile. The car arrived here, and, uh, and I tended to you. It must be nice to be reminded that you have friends you can count on. And then there are friends who do things like this. He could have killed you. Alfred, John is just... He has trouble controlling his impulses. And sometimes he acts without thinking. Okay, maybe more than sometimes. I know you care for him, Bruce, but he's hurt people. A lot of people. And I... Well, I'm sorry to say, but it's only gotten worse. Computer, bring up all live news feeds. Filter for the word Joker. Gotham is still picking up the pieces after a man calling himself Joker led an assault on the GCPD. There has been no confirmation whether Amanda Waller, director of the agency, is still alive. The pursuit led onto the sidewalk where frightened citizens don't recover. Officers chased the madman for hours after the attack, we know but that lost him in the chaos. Eleven people were seriously this injured. This has many wondering: Who is the Joker? Where did he come from? And where will his reign of terror end? You advised him to try and rein in his urges. Reports have confirmed eight casualties. And you appear to be waiting for him to succeed in that, after everything he's done. You helped make him, you know. Excuse me? This Joker? From the start, John has hung on your every word. Bend over backwards to please you. Your influence is everywhere in him. Even the part of you that is darkest. And now he is that. I can't give up on him, Al. There's still a chance I can bring him back from the edge. You're not? What, Al? Nothing. I'm sorry, I... I shouldn't have said all that to you, the, the shape you're in. I've had too much time to think while you've been recovering. Careful now. All the way up, Batman. It's time to meet your new partner. <laughs> sorry, my what? Uh, that was your cue, dear. Did you not... I'm not ready! Tiffany. Yes. 
is my partner. I was hesitant at first, but I just couldn't talk her out of it, Bruce. She has your drive, your passion. Just like when you became Batman. That's a difficult thing to say no to. After Lucius died, you mentioned that we should recruit. Well, now we have. At least hear her out. All right. I'm trusting you on this one. If you think something like this can work, then I'm willing to give it a shot. Oh, I'm not sure about this at all. But I wasn't sure about Batman either. I may have my doubts, but... You need the help right now, and I mean you to have it. <sighs> you have to put a stop to him, Bruce. I know you will, but... Whatever feelings you may have had for John... Don't let him use them against you. You can't allow him to cloud your judgment. You don't know John like I do. He still considers me his best friend. He wouldn't abuse that. He's a killer, Bruce. A maniac who kidnapped the head of the world's top intelligence agency. You can't go on blind hope that he will be the man you once knew. While you were out, I've kept abreast of the authorities' search for Joker and his associates. Uh, as for the GCPD, they've investigated John's other favorite haunt, the Stacked Deck. Interviews there yielded nothing useful, other than the fact John and a few of his regulars he's recruited to his cause haven't frequented the establishment in over a week or so. Willie Deaver on the left, and that's Frank Dumfrey. John has often mentioned he misses Arkham. Maybe he's hiding there. I, I thought of that. I'm afraid our own drone network has come up empty in a search of the asylum grounds and its catacombs. The agency searched the subway lair the Pact had been using. They found nothing and raised what was left to the ground. Waller set up a stake out of the funhouse after her agent's bodies were found. She has people there around the clock. John's gone to ground and in none of the usual places that we know about. I'm done. My word. Well, you certainly look the part. Just wait till you see what it can do. Oh, my God. Bruce, are you okay? Don't worry. It looks worse than it is. Yes, you get used to him lying like this, unfortunately. Is this... Is this what happens to you all the time? Not all the time. Just the bad days. It's a long shot, but the water tower, where Joker set his ambush for the agency, it's still an active crime scene. With a little bit of luck, there may be something there I can use to track him. I'm coming with you. Chemical sniffers, advanced sensor suites, early warning defense nodes, all with sync capability directly to your cow. It scans and catalogs evidence in a nanosecond. Maybe even faster than the back computer. It's even got some defensive options. Non-lethal, of course. It sounds like a plan. I won't let you down. I won't let either of you down. Let's get to work. You'll need these. For the pain. You, uh, you're forgetting something.
nervous. Isn't everyone before their first crime scene? How do you... I mean... How do we do this? Take the lead. Wait, what? We're here to find something that gets us closer to finding Joker. Focus on that. Show me how it's done, Miss Fox. Okay, then. Watch and learn. Oh, God. That's not how it's supposed to sound. That needs some work. You'll get it. Batman, I didn't expect to see you here. <clears throat> We're here to help, Detective. My partner and I need to examine the area. We may find something that'll lead us to Joker's whereabouts. Your partner? We might not be able to give you a lot of time. With Waller kidnapped and me getting canned, no one's sure whose jurisdiction this crime scene falls under. The agencies or the GCPDs. So for now, let's go ahead and say it's yours, all right? My people are here to help however they can. Glad you're here, Jim. I'd heard that... Technically, I'm not here. Not in an official capacity, anyway. Working outside of the law. Let me know if you need any pointers. What should we be looking for? After the pack separated, Joker had to find somewhere else to hide. There could be clues here that tell us where that is. And where he may have taken Waller. So this partnership between you and Batman, when did that happen? It's new. Venom. His suit was punctured. It's everywhere. Is it useful? No. Not in finding Joker. I'll add it to ignore on the drone search filters. Festive. But not a lead. Hmm. Not sure Riddler would like the new decor. This Joker guy going nuts. I heard it started with Riddler's murder, but he's blaming Waller for it. Wouldn't actually surprise me. Riddler's murder? Really? But maybe it was always just a matter of time before he snapped. Mark. W.D. Willie Deaver, Joker's associate. What do you have on him? Machinist by trade, with a storied employment history. He's been fired from almost every factory and chemical plant in Gotham. Has a drinking problem, apparently. We're gonna need to narrow this down a bit. Hey, can I see your notes? Uh, sure thing, kid. Is this... You write your notes on paper. Yeah, well, I put them in the computer when I get to the office. I mean, you could put them down in a phone. Kid, look. I'll keep looking. Welcome, Agency Pigs. <laughs> Here I thought that was our nickname. I miss this, you know. You and me raking over a crime scene? Oh, uh, I messed it up, didn't I? Now, in the early days when we were chasing you, not realizing you were one of the good guys, you and I came to an agreement. We'd work together to make Gotham safer. I lost my head the other day. I want you to know I'm sorry. I cracked, like I said I would when Waller first moved in. You were just doing what you thought was right, Jim. 
There's nothing to apologize for. You're a good man for saying that. I've missed this too. Got something interesting. It's a faint signal. Electrical burns. From the agency guns? Hmm. They were firing wildly. It's a subpar design for a firearm. Too prone to misfire. Electrical discharge heats the barrel too quickly, causing erratic fire patterns. Ah, huh. so you're also an expert on guns. I've designed a few myself, actually. A controller to the shot collars that Waller's using on the pact. Damaged. Can you isolate the signal from this device? Sure, but why? I've seen what these collars can do. Might come in handy. Nothing of note. Joker's knife. Must have lost it after he went into a frenzy against Bane. John Doe thought he could take on Bane? He's not half bad in the fight, actually. Bane's blood won't lead us to Joker. Forensics ran it through the system. Found it was stolen from the stack deck a few weeks ago. I recognize it. It's been customized since then. My drone can analyze it. Just point and I'll shoot. Get some details on this paint. Funny. Doesn't look like a rush job. Because it's not. The drone sees a body shop quality strip below the top layer. The paint uses a stripping solvent that hasn't met compliance standards since. Cross-referencing this with Willie Deaver's employment history. There's only one match. Ace Chemicals. Their main plant was shut down last year after the city cited them for multiple safety violations. Because of the paint. The plant's been abandoned ever since. Perfect hiding spot. We found it. Well, well, well. What's all this, then? A bat and a walking mustache trespassing on my crime scene. You escaped. <laughs> you got it all wrong, baddie boy. I'm here on agency business. <sighs> For the love of God. That's right. I'm one of the good guys now. So hand over everything you found before I knock out those pearly whites. In the name of the law. Batman, we don't have time to mess around with this clown. Make time, copper. You all take orders from me now. I don't take orders from you, Quinn. Stand down. Let me show you how things work around here now, Batsy. This is Agent Quinn, suppressing fire. from Big Bad Joker. They'll do anything for me. So all you gotta do is tell me where John took her so I can get back to my job. After all, Johnny Boy and I are due for a nice long talk. You know him better than anyone. Let's work together on this. Oh, now there's an idea. 
You can tee him up, and I'll knock his head off his shoulders with my government-issued hammer. We're taking him alive. That's so. Your offer just got way less interesting. <laughs> and here I thought being diplomatic would work with you people. Oh well, I'll try something you can understand. I need to... uh, hey, you cops can't just shoot people like that. I'm off duty. Hello? What's the girl got a... those collars in my sleep. Sending you off to Blackgate, where you belong. <laughs> oh, please! The agency isn't gonna let me sit in a cell. I'm an asset. I'm gonna get what I want, and there's not a damn thing you can do about it. Even if you escape this, you'll never be free. I will hunt you down until you pay for everything you've done. You don't scare me. I've outrun you before. I'll do it again. Go find Joker before he carves up Waller. I'll clean up this mess. Have your people hold back until I call them. Waller's life may depend on a stealthy approach. <laughs> Batman. Good hunting. Visual on Joker and Waller. Doesn't look like he's hurt her. Not yet. I'm in the rafters, out of sight. Say the word if you need help. Thanks. Bruce, I know you and Waller have your differences, but she doesn't deserve this. I take complete responsibility. Louder. So the camera can pick it up. Took you long enough. Batman! Thank God! I mean, I assumed you'd be okay. You're Batman, for Pete's sake. But still, are you okay, buddy? I was really worried about you. I'm fine. Of course you are. No way would a couple pesky bombs take you out. <laughs> Things got crazy on that roof, huh? I had to do something. Waller was about to walk away. Get this. I'm this close 
to getting Waller to admit to every terrible thing she's ever done. And when that's over, I'll deliver her punishment. It'll, of course, have to reflect the enormity of her crimes. Waller needs to go to trial. Maybe spend the rest of her life in a cell. But not whatever this is. Do you know how long that would take? You know, I... I don't know why you're not more into this. Think of everything she's put you through! Everyone is disposable to her! Even her own agents! I know I've made mistakes. You try to do the right thing, but there's always a cost. Just ask your pal Batman there. He'll say the same thing. I do what I do for a reason. I'm not ashamed. You do it for yourself. You didn't want that virus to keep people safe. You wanted to use it to advance your career. My career is how I keep people safe. I fight... You're totally right. She sucks! Let's keep the show rolling. We've heard your excuses. You didn't mean for people to get hurt. Collateral damage, yada yada yada. But there's one crime that can't be excused. You killed the Riddler! And then you tried to pin it on me! I didn't kill him, like I said. It was you! You killed Riddler! Say it! I will not. There's one thing I learned by watching you. Violence solves a lot of problems! about justice. You have a grudge against her. That's the only reason you're doing any of this. A grudge? Batman? She tried to kill me. I told you why I'm doing this. But you aren't listening. You're never listening. Just saying what you think will control me. Just like Lawler. She justifies her crimes. Says they're for the greater good. Just like you. You both use that word, justice, as an excuse, so you can do whatever you want. I thought you and I were two threads in the same stitch. I'm nothing like Waller. You're either lying or stupid, Bats. I don't know why I didn't see it sooner. Trying to do things your way was a mistake. Waller killed Riddler. <gasps> He deserves death! It wasn't Waller! Tiffany? I can't let someone else pay for my crimes. Waller didn't kill Riddler. I did. I know it was wrong. Now. Oh God, are you kidding me? These are the people you want to protect. I should kill them both. Everyone here is guilty! <laughs> this is... this is a joke! Get back, Tiffany! No! I've kept this in the dark for too long! I used a drone and these! There's your proof! You want to sacrifice yourself for Waller? Then go ahead! <laughs> Just hold on. Murder is wrong. 
trust. The system. Violence isn't the answer. People just pick and choose what they believe. And you're no different. <laughs> Yeah. 
You too. I think the circumstances allow. Gordon was telling me how you found me. Sounds like top drawer detective work. It was a team effort. Batman led the charge. It's not easy to say this, but it looks like you saved my life. I guess that puts me in your debt. You owe me. And I will collect. Jim, would you mind giving us a minute? Batman and I have some unfinished business. I'll go check on Joker's transfer, make sure they don't take any chances. Just try not to rip each other's heads off, okay? We can all play nice now that the bad guy's in cuffs. Joker's no longer a threat. Catwoman's collar. It comes off. She goes free. Fair. You don't have to worry. Our stalemate from the roof still stands. I'm pulling out of Gotham effective immediately. Then why are we still talking? Tiffany Fox. Riddler's death may have caused a lot of problems, but I won't make her pay for it. I'll leave that to the man who can't stand killing. I know you think I'm the devil, but I want you to understand. I didn't want... I didn't see things going down like this. I let the mission get out from under me. Never really regained a solid footing. Watch out, Waller. Or you might stumble onto an actual apology. You let me talk, we might get there. I just came here to round up the pact. Quick and easy. And if Riddler led you to Sanctus, that would have been a bonus. Listen. Everything I did, I did for the greater good. To protect Gotham, to uphold the law, to make the world a safer place. You did what you thought was right. I won't judge you. Who knows? Maybe our paths will cross again in the future. Maybe we can work together again. On equal footing, of course. 
I could see us accomplishing great things. Tiffany, we need to talk. Yeah, I figured. You're hurt. It's nothing. I saw you take much worse. Joker was going to cut Waller ear to ear. I had to create a distraction. It was certainly distracting. My confession. It took you by surprise, didn't it? I just couldn't keep it in anymore. You know I don't condone killing. Not even scum like Riddler. I've been dreading this moment. Especially since I learned who you are under that mask. I was afraid of what might happen if you found out. I guess I was hoping you never would. Why didn't you talk to me sooner? I... I wanted to work with you, to be part of your mission. But you kept this from me. A murder? I know. I'm sorry. I knew this would ruin everything. You were right. Riddler tore my family apart, Bruce. My mother hasn't left the house since the funeral. And Luke? He just lashes out. My father's death broke them. It broke all of us. I won't ask for forgiveness. But I hope you can understand why I had to do it. I just felt so powerless. Like my life was crumbling around me. Revenge is an impulse, one to be checked. I can't condone it. But I do understand it. Thank you. That means a lot. I couldn't bear it if you despised me. So? Where do we go from here? I suppose this puts me on your most wanted. If you want to fill your father's shoes, you need to learn right from wrong. You need someone to teach you. you you're giving me a second chance? Think of it more as a sentence. You'll have to work hard for your redemption. I promise I won't let you down. Then let's get started. I was going to write a note, but I'm not a coward. At least I don't want to be. Not anymore. 
Then again, this won't be the first time I've found my courage in a single malt. Courage for what? Saying goodbye. I'm leaving, Bruce. It's time I went in search of better pastures. You just need rest, Alfred. Why don't you take a long vacation? Like we talked about. Some place in the sun, on the other side of the world from Gotham. I rather think this vacation will be permanent. But why? This war of ours is not what it was when we started. I no longer have the stomach for it. It's not sustainable. At least not for me. So take a back seat from the operations. Put your feet up for a while. Keep us stocked with cucumber sandwiches and tea. And just stand idly by while your enemies rend you limb from limb. Do a little dusting while you bleed out on the Batcave floor. I don't think so. Our mission used to be so clear. Catch the criminals, lock them up. But nothing is clear anymore. At least not to me. Now everything has become so gray. <laughs> gray? Talk to me, Alfred. We used John Doe, exploited his friendship to get you into the pact. We took advantage of someone you met in an asylum, for God's sake. I'll admit that wasn't our finest moment, but at the time it seemed like our best course of action. Precisely my point. Our best judgment is no longer good enough. You empowered John Doe, kept him close when you should have put him away, inspired him to become something far more dangerous than he ever was. What's your point? Sometimes it's as if Batman creates the evil he means to destroy. For all our good intentions, I fear we only make things worse. A dreadful thought, I know, but one that keeps me awake at night. Oh, please. There were plenty of criminals around before Batman showed up. I put most of them in jail. Two-Face, Cobblepot, Lady Arkham, Joker. All they have in common is you. Anyone who comes into contact with us suffers. Lucius is gone. Tiffany has blood on her hands. I foolishly thought bringing her in might make things better. As if her enthusiasm might remind us how things were in the beginning. We put her in danger on her first day, dodging machine guns at a crime scene. The lives we touch are touched by pain. Friends, colleagues, innocents. No one is spared. You think I want that? We can fix the problem, Al, but not if we run from it. Unless we are the problem. Leaving this all behind might be the only solution. One thing is for certain, my tremors are gone. <laughs> That's great news, Al. They stopped the minute I made the decision to go. I thought it was the kidnapping with Lady Arkham that caused them. Some kind of residual trauma. But I had it wrong. This sense of powerlessness I've been feeling, it came from something I saw in you. The tremors. The fainting spells. Alfred, I'm... I'm so sorry. I've caused you so much pain. No, no, please, don't misunderstand me. Let me explain. Your father was driven by an obsession, by a need to control. He rushed headlong into the darkness, thinking himself invincible, oblivious to the cost. Just like you. Not like me. I chase that darkness away. And yet, history is repeating itself. I'm more certain of that with every passing day. Okay, maybe I am more like my father than I want to admit, but our paths are different. Can't you see? The paths may diverge, but they end in the same place. Face down in an alley, shot in the dark by criminals in some godforsaken corner of Gotham. I won't be witness to that. I won't bury you, too. I stood by and did nothing while Thomas destroyed himself along with everything he loved. I enabled him, like I've been enabling you. Realizing this, I've never felt so helpless. I wanted things to be different for you, my boy. You deserved a better life than the one I gave you. I failed you, and for that I'm sorry. You did the best you could, Al. 
In a single night, the family was shattered, and you were left to pick up the pieces. I may have picked them up, but I did a poor job sticking them back together. Well, I don't want to miss my flight. There's always traffic around the airport. You don't have to do it, Bruce. There are other ways of doing good in the world. But you, you pour everything into your bloody crusade. And I know you too well to hope you'll ever change. Alfred, wait. Would you stay if I promised things would be different? Is that a promise you can keep? Like you said, there are a lot of ways to help. I'm sure the city could use a man of my talent and resources. Are you sure about this? I'll do whatever it takes to keep our family together, Al. Even this. So please. Tell me you'll stay. Well, maybe just one more night. You got that look in your eye, the kind that says you're trouble. Thunderbolt! I'm the whole goddamn hurricane! Gotham's safety is slipping out from under me and I can't stand it! my options and what can I say I don't like to lose I won't let you down
Visitor for John Doe. Bruce! War always carries a cost, and my war on crime is no different. The truth is, no matter how hard I fight, sometimes I have to lose. In order to save Selena from this fate, I had to give myself up. My life for hers. Now, there's nothing to stop Harley Quinn and her crew from killing everyone at the Sanctus facility and stealing a virus that could wipe out Gotham. Meanwhile, I face the cold embrace. I'm here. I'm here. Harley had me thrown into one of Freeze's cryo chambers. But I'm okay now. Oh, well, that's a relief. I'm afraid I was starting to panic. I've got it under control, Alfred. Is the pact still in the subway? No. I'm bringing the car around. Call Waller. Tell her the pact means to slaughter their way into Sanctus, and I'm going after it. What? Have you shot on sight, Bruce? I'm not going as Bruce. It's time to let Batman handle things.
Alfred. I'm in. Any sign of Harley or the others? spa workers. More death and destruction. This blood trail looks like they dragged something. for Project Lotus. Do you have access? It's got to scan my eyes. <sighs> Another use for Riddler's eyes. Call it for me. No way. Those freaks are down there. They'll kill me if they see me. If you do it, I can stop the intruders that attacked you. I'm not supposed to let anyone in there. But... All right. You gotta stop them. Send paramedics. I've already made the call. to Director Waller. She, um, wants to speak with you. Now. Put her through. Batman, where are you? Give me a status update. I'm at the Sanctus facility. I split with the Pact, and they beat me here. It's a bloodbath. I ordered you not to blow your cover. What the hell were you thinking? You could have been there to prevent this. You're right. I made a mistake. It's too late to change anything now. Just get your damn head on straight. We'll be there to back you up soon. We're gonna put an end to this once and for all. Looks like Sanctus security barely slowed them down. That's why you have to keep them there until we arrive. That virus cannot be allowed to leave the facility. Don't mess this up again. This door lock requires a key card. Here. 
someone's trapped under there. Just injure yourself more. It's too late for that. Stop them. Here, take my. anything unless I say so. We don't know what half this stuff done. What are you doing? You saved my life by taking the rap for the laptop theft. I'm returning the favor. I'm on guard duty along with three gunmen who are all watching that door up ahead. If I hadn't stopped you, you'd be full of holes right now. We don't always see eye to eye, but I'd much prefer you in one piece. I'm just glad to see you alive. Same. After seeing them throw you in Frieza's meat locker, I wasn't sure if that was the end. I've seen a lot of death recently. Hardly encouraged Frieza and Bane. They killed anyone they wanted. I should have done something more to stop them. But I didn't. Fake! What did I say about touching the equipment? <laughs> Be quiet, you and monsieur! I'm going to make this right. I'll help you stop them. Whatever I have to do, they're not getting that virus. Good. We'll fight them together. That's exactly what I wanted to hear. Anything in here could kill you. So keep your hands to yourself. Let's do this. I suppose I should have seen this coming. 
She's become more and more erratic since she came to Gotham. I hardly know what she's going to do next. Harley? No. Director Waller. You say she can't keep secrets from you. I never thought she'd have reason to keep them from me. Ah, damn! Ow! Ah, the hell is wrong with this thing? Oh, damn it, sorry. I, I, I've got a passive anti-surveillance system running. It must have triggered What did your... you say, Bruce? Looked like you were speaking, but can't hear so well without these. I, I was saying I'm sorry. Crappy agency technology. Not your fault. You know what I mean. Look, it's fine. I'd just rather not talk about it. I have to admit, a part of me was sort of hoping we'd be taking the Batmobile. Not that this car isn't great. Oh, we are taking it. I don't follow. I push a button, the armor plates flip, and voila. Batmobile. That's incredible. If you're not just pulling my leg. Yeah. Lucius Fox was a genius. You've put a lot of time and energy into this crusade. I prefer to think of it as a mission. Do you ever question it? Not the mission. I mean, the methods. The clandestine nature of what you do. The fear tactics. The occasional brutality. No judgment. No. Never. Damn. I wish I had that kind of confidence. I'm having a bit of an existential crisis. Existential crisis? <sighs> yeah. It's Waller. Why wouldn't she want us to know what Freeze told you? Things have gotten gray recently. Too gray. I don't know if I'm on the right side anymore. Maybe I shouldn't have brought this up. So what are you saying? I wish I knew exactly. I was hoping talking to you might give me some clarity. Hey, you sure you're okay to do this? Absolutely. You know, I looked through Gordon's case files about Harley. Her father suffered from mental illness that eventually drove him to suicide. An illness with a strong hereditary link. It's very possible she wants the serum to prevent the same thing happening to her. If she fails, she's got one deadly plan B. <laughs> Don't sound so worried, Batman. I'm here to help. We're almost there. Freeze me to death. Then we're on the same page. <laughs> Harley. She must be gone already. Do you think that means she already has the vials? I don't know. But it's worth a look. Maybe she got scared off before she could find them.
Damn it. What is it? They're gone. The vials are gone. So... Keep looking. C4, plastic explosive. Only a little, though. Must be remnants from something bigger. I don't remember Bane making bombs, and it doesn't match Freeze's M.O. Wonder if whoever took the vials also made a bomb. C4 certainly doesn't sound like the agency. Who then? Harley? John? Even money on both. Dried. Must be from when Harley shot Bane's men. Hey, Avesta, does this look familiar? We call it a liminal device, a not quite as powerful phalanx key. Some agency field ops are issued one, and if they left it, they must have been rushed. An agency team has been here. C4 doesn't seem like agency issue. No, but with Waller these days, who knows? supposed to preserve him obviously it failed right decomposition is actually accelerated they purposefully disabled the capsule if that's the case then they were trying to destroy the body it's textbook asset denial but it's some sloppy work they were moving fast too fast If Harley decides to release the virus, that sample may be the most valuable weapon we have. Alfred, I did a bioscan of Riddler's corpse. I'm sending the data to you. The body is breaking down, so do your best with it. Received, Bruce. It's... Oh my. This may take a bit of time. So, Waller takes the blood and has Riddler's body destroyed. would make her the only player who could create a viable Project Lotus sample. Having all the pieces to the puzzle. Oh my god. Bruce. The Pact all had problems. Medical problems they needed solving. And if Waller's the solution, she can make them work for her. She's not above using leverage to get people under her thumb. I mean, look what she did with my identity. Harley. The virus. Where is she, John? Where's Harley? I don't think we've been formally introduced. Doe. John Doe. 
She's a friend, John. Our friend. I had a friend. It didn't work out. Oh, hey! Hold on. Are you two timing cat lady, Bruce? <clears throat> she was here. Wait, she was here? Yeah. Where is she now, John? This is important. You got some real nerve. You know that? Buddy! Remember the cafe? Just be yourself, John. Did I stuck my neck out for you? Way out! Bane nearly ripped my head off. And for what? She flew the coop! I have nothing. You steered me wrong. At every turn, every bad piece of advice, everything blew up in my face. This isn't my fault. Harley betrayed us, both of us. Yeah, but you weren't in love with her. There's no point. It's over. The pact, the dream. Us. Not yet, it's not. She's still out there, with a deadly virus, in a city full of innocent people. Call me when you got something I care about. It always surprises me how heavy guns are. It's gonna be okay, John. I promise. I care, John. You know that. I'm nearly out of reasons to believe you anymore, Bruce. Well, it's been real. What are you doing, John? Leaving. There's nothing left for me here. A lot of bad memories. And a weird smell. John, I understand you want to run. I've run before. But problems, they just come with you, no matter how far you go. Nope. Pretty sure I can get away from that smell. Damn it, John. Listen to me. I need to find Harley. I don't want to do this anymore. Not for you. Not for her. John, please. This is important. I know it hasn't been easy for us, but I am your friend. Hey, buddy. Look, the agency was here. They took the blood. I was up here in a very dark place. They didn't find me, but Harley did. I told her what happened to Riddler. <laughs> she gave me this. And where do you think Miss Quinn is now? We'd like to find her sooner. Rather than later. I don't want to find her. My heart can't take another kicking. I don't ever want to see her again. She ruined me. I, I can't. Help me bring her to justice. It's what she deserves, John. I just can't say no to you, Bruce. <laughs> Gotta keep an eye on this guy. That Wayne charm gets him every time. You sure know how to spin things. All the right ways to uh, twist my arm. It's going to take me a few hours to find her. I have to check a few places, do some things. Okay, we'll come with you. <laughs> no, you won't. There will be plenty of time for John and Bruce later. This is... I need to do this alone. I'll call you when I find something. Wait, hold on. I really like your help, John. It's okay. Go. Bruce, let's talk about this. He'll come through. He's done it before. It's funny. When you first walked through that door, I honestly thought you came here to check on me. I'm going to track down those vials in the agency's cold storage. Be careful. Thanks. 
Alfred, how's the bioscan analysis going? Nearly complete. I should have it ready for you when you arrive. I'm on my way. I'm taking over at the computer. What's the matter? Uh, Thomas, uh, let's... let's chat. Now's the time. Won't be long. No, Al, it's me. It's Bruce. Yes. What would Master Bruce think about what you've done? I don't know. He... he, he and the, the, the Cobblepot boy are playmates. Please, please wake up. Bruce, I... Where, where, where am I? Easy, easy. You're in the cave. Take your time, think back, and tell me exactly what happened. Oh, no, it was... It was nothing. I was... I was working, and I felt... I felt dizzy for a moment. Uh, I, I must have been more exhausted than I realized. Uh, and, well, basically, that's all there is to it. First it's your hand shaking, and now you're... You're passing out. We can't keep ignoring this. You need to be looked at before it gets worse. Uh, oh, Jed. Hey, uh, hey, 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 be careful. Oh, oh. Thank you, Bruce. I'll just catch my breath. Just give me a moment, please. It's all nonsense. What is? Freeze's magic cure-all. It doesn't work as intended. Take a look. Lotus. Megavirus. Only one known survivor. Riddler. Freeze thinks his blood is now a key to unlocking Lotus's true potential. The bioscan of Riddler's body. I used the analysis you sent me to simulate its interaction with the virus. And the bat computer promptly found holes in Freeze's calculations. It appears that Lotus can be synthesized into a restorative agent for the human body. A remarkable one. Well, Freeze got that part right, but... But as soon as Lotus repairs any physical problems, it causes irreparable damage to the subject's brain chemistry. It drives you insane. It's what Riddler meant when he said, I wasn't always like this. All of these people, all of them trying to kill each other for something that will make them as deranged as he was in the end. We all should know by now that miracles come with a cost. Lotus is nothing more than a poison. It's only because they think they found Eden, a way to cure all of their problems. Men rarely share their prosperity, even if it brings them ruin. The fools. Run the simulation again, then forward the readings to Special Agent Imana Vesta. Uh, I already ran it several times myself. Uh, I, I wanted to, to be thorough. Silly notion, I know. My problems are purely psychological. My real cure is a very long vacation. Somewhere far away from Gotham. 
A place where the sun actually comes to visit. Then let's get you to a nice beach, huh? Or wherever you want to go. Ooh, the possibilities. That'll take some thinking. Avesta. I read your report. The serum makes the whole thing beyond dangerous. Did you find out where Waller's keeping Riddler's blood? Yeah. She's got the area on lockdown, but I think I can get myself in. And then I'm taking these things off the table. Permanently. Just hold on. Let me find a way to help. You've got to be around in case John finds Harley. And this needs to be done quickly. I won't let Waller turn the agency back into something like Sanctus, Bruce. The vials have to go. Good luck. Let's get you somewhere more comfortable. Oh, Bruce. Uh, Tiffany's up there. She's probably wondering where I hurried off to. Sorry, Albert. We can't risk you falling again. Very well. Oh, we, we mustn't keep Tiffany worrying any longer. She's done quite enough of that the past few days. Ready? I'm afraid that's all we do. Worry the ones closest to us. Okay, yes, thank you. The doctor is on her way. How are you feeling? Well, better. A little more rest and some tea, and I'll be as good as new. Make that a lot more rest, Alfred. You're hurt. The only thing hurt is my pride. Which, sadly, even the doctor won't be able to fix. You can put up a strong front, but I'm not leaving your side until the doctor arrives. Got it? Understood. Be straight with me. How worried should I be? You don't need to sugarcoat it. I'll let Alfred tell you himself. I told you, I'm fine. Yeah, I'm sorry, it's just... There's a lot more to worry about right now than me. So... Bruce... Um, after our little talk at your office, I had an idea. There's something I want to show you. So, I've been working on this in my spare time. I remember you said you could use the help, you know, when you're Batman. I started thinking about a tactical suit, in case I'm ever needed in the field. para aramid synthetic lining. Photo-adaptive suit coloring. Full-spectrum, full-surround heads-up display. I should be able to get the mesh fabricated in no time. I'm getting ahead of myself. The last thing you want is me out there on the rooftops with you. This wasn't all just about me. You've been going up against some heavy opposition, Bruce. More than usual. Alfred told me how Bane nearly killed you. So I designed you this. That's a gun. Let me read you the specs. That man doesn't use guns, Tiffany. You mean, at all? I guess I've never seen you use one. But I didn't realize that was... Like, a rule. I hate guns, Tiffany. Ever since I was a boy. I forgot. I'm sorry. Still, criminals are always trying to kill Batman. Are you telling me you've never once considered a gun? Just to even the odds. Of course I think about it sometimes. It'd be the easiest thing in the world. But easy doesn't make it right. Bingo. 
Listen, I should have thought it through more. I just got so caught up in the design, I didn't... I have a lot left to learn. Now, don't be so hard on yourself. to go. We'll be waiting right here. John? Dr. Quinzel, this is Harley's. It's easy on me, you know? What are we going to say to Bruce? It, 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 it wasn't me. I, I, I mean, it, it was me, but it, it was self-defense. I, I know it needs work. Stop judging me. Bruce? I'm so glad you're here. Please, it just... It, it's, it's not what it looks like. Explain. Just try and reserve judgment. Take a deep breath, John. Just calm down. It was horrible. Just horrible. But you're, you're right. I, I should do my exercises. Get a hold of myself. What happened? Is Harley here? 
she left just as I got here. The agents, they came looking for her. They're not supposed to just start shooting, Bruce. They're supposed to say, hands up. I've seen it on the TV. They just attacked you. I tried to talk sense into them, but they wouldn't listen. They, they just wanted blood. Something took hold of me. Something dark and vicious and desperate for survival. I grabbed the nearest thing and started swinging. <laughs> you think this is funny? I'm sorry. I, I always laugh when I'm nervous. You said you hit them with something. I think so. I, I just grabbed whatever came to hand. This woman has a gunshot wound. Oh, really? In the back. Oh, yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's coming back to me now. She was going for her partner's gun, and I, I just, I just went on autopilot. I didn't stop until I was safe. I've just been sitting here in the dark until you came in okay well, sounds sounds like you did what you had to do exactly it was a real life or death moment i just sort of closed my eyes and hoped for the best i felt so much rage inside me bruce it was terrifying it was like it was like i became someone else Someone dangerous, but someone you want around when your back's against the wall. Well, I hope you're okay now. You think you're back to your normal self? Normal? Yes. I feel much better. Thank you. You don't have to worry about a thing. It was a momentary episode. A, a flash in the pan. It won't be a problem. I promise. You, you believe me, don't you? You have faith in your good old buddy John, right? Of course I believe you. Oh, good! Thank you, Bruce. Thank you, thank you. I wasn't sure I could count on you. Not after the raid. It's been hard, knowing you haven't been straight with me, Bruce. Keeping your secrets. When we're supposed to have all this trust between us. I've always been honest with you, John. Oh, Bruce! We both know that's not true. You forget? I know you. The real you. Always hiding behind some kind of mask. Playboy, businessman, criminal, bad. You can't fool a friend. Someone who really takes the time to look. You are the Batman. Well done, John. You figured it out. I've got to say I'm impressed. Only because you underestimate me. After you fell on your own sword to save Catsy, there was no more doubt. So what? You think you can use that against me, huh? Blackmail me? I would never! We're two threads in the same stitch, remember? Oh, my head feels all messed up right now. I need a purpose. I know where Harley is. She took a truck out of the city, across the Gotham Bridge. Let me help you stop her. You and me, Batman. We can clean up this city. Together. Unless... Uh, uh, unless the 
stitch is truly broken. When this is over, we will have a very serious talk about all this. But right now, let's go find Harley. We'll bring her in together. Oh, gosh. Thank you, Bruce. I'm going to such great things. Uh, oh, <laughs> sorry about the blood. We've got to catch up with Harley before these murderous agents find her. She's got explosives and the virus. If they start shooting, things could get really exciting. Oh, boy! <laughs> if I had known these were your wheels, I never would have stolen that beater. safe, John. You don't have to worry. Hearing you say that really calms my nerves. Wayne, about time you showed up. 
What in the good goddamn is he doing here? Director Waller, John Doe's, uh, been aiding Bruce's investigations. This creature's with you? Amanda Waller, meet John Doe. He's a trusted friend. I'm, uh, I'm here to defuse the situation. I have my doubts, but hell. At this point, I'll try anything. Harley's making demands we simply can't meet. Her detonator's on a dead man switch. She lets it go. This bridge is history. This situation is rapidly spiraling out of control. I'm running out of options. Harley is heading towards a cliff, and she's gonna drag all of us with her. I know you took the blood. Why don't you just give it to her and save all of us the pain? I can't do that. One of my own people tampered with Riddler's blood. Someone inside the agency. The serum Quinn wanted to make is off the table for good. It's destroyed. Why don't we let Bruce try negotiating? He spent a lot of time with Harley recently. <sighs> Give it a shot, Bruce. See what you can do. Stand down, people. Let him through. Well, well, Bruce Wayne. Harley. You made it out of the icebox. Good for you. Should have guessed you were working with Walla. Had me fooled. Up to a point. All I want is Riddler's blood. I get it. I leave Gotham for good. That agency hellbeast says she don't got it, but I know she's lying through her teeth. The serum you're trying to make, it doesn't do what you think it does. How do you know about that? Because I looked into it. It does as much harm as it does good, maybe more. Harley, you're a doctor. You have to understand. It destroys your brain chemistry. Uh-huh. Sure. You're gonna tell me you love me, Wayne? Excuse me? I like a little romance when I'm getting screwed. I'm holding all the goddamn cards. Either they give me what I want, or I play the one that goes BOOM! I ain't fooling around. I'll do it without a second thought. Listen, I have pull with these people. You turn yourself in. I can protect you. Good, Bruce. That's the way. She just needs to see she'll be taken care of. I don't need protection. Never have. The way I see it, you need protection from me. Stand down! Bruce, you got her warmed up. Don't let me take it from here. Uh, couldn't? Let me talk to her. I know her better than anyone. I'm so glad you're here, baby. These deadbeats want my head on a stick. You can do it, John. I believe in you. I won't let you down. I have everything worked out. Up here. Trust me. I've learned from the best. Okay, just... Just what? Tell her what she wants to hear. You mean I should ignore what you said in the cafe? About being myself? Whatever it takes to make her give up that detonator. That sounds like a terrible idea, Bruce. Harley, you'll see straight through me if I try anything shady. Hey, don't worry about a thing. With all these people watching, how can I not live up to the occasion? Those two reprobates getting their heads together is a recipe for a disaster. Oh, what were you thinking? John said it himself. He knows her better than anyone. As long as he keeps her talking, there's still a chance she won't blow the bridge. There's truth in that. Not enough to inspire confidence, but it's better than nothing.
Gotta be kidding. This is going south. We're gonna shut this down right now. If we interfere now, we could push him right back into Harley's arms. If we don't, everyone on this bridge will die. Stand by to move in, people. Alpha team, move into flank. What the hell do you think you're doing? You gotta trust him, Waller. I'm telling you, he'll come through. With a marriage proposal, maybe. Not a successful resolution to the crisis at hand. You need to have faith. Stand down. You backstabbing piece of crap! Uh. Don't struggle, Harley. They think you're a fighter. They're gonna put you in the hole. I'm gonna rip your head off, you two diamond son of a... Get her out of here. How could you, John? You broke my heart. Bruce showed me how to be good, Harley. In a way you never could. Thank you for your help, Mr. Doe. You did a great job. The virus, please. I don't think so. I don't think anyone should have this. Least of all you. Well then, we'll no longer be requiring your service. No! What are you doing? He helped us. You betrayed me after I saved the day. <sighs> you hated some people. You're just the worst. Find that bag and get Quinn in the truck immediately. Where's Wayne? I want him secured. Subdue him if you have to. Ha, 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 ha! 